And I'm particularly interested in, in egalitarian income sharing communities because I feel like it's a direct challenge to the whole sort of capitalist hierarchical mentality. Um, in a normal situation, you know, a normal job, what you have is a bunch of people who are working, doing, some of them were working harder than the others, I think, but that's not necessarily how they're paid. There's a real hierarchy in terms of how people are paid, and um, you know, it's kind of like society says, I value this CEO much more important than, say, a single mother who's you know, struggling and stuff like that. In an egalitarian income sharing community, egalitarian means everybody's equal, and what happens is everybody basically is in the same financial boat together. Uh, nobody gets more money than anybody else, regardless of what you do. That um, it, it's, in a way, it's really fair. It's kind of saying we value each person, and everybody gets enough in order to survive. And you know, um, I'm also an advocate of simple living, um, which. The communities don't come out and say, but but uh, as a default, that's what ends up happening, which is that um, the part of the way the capitalist system is set up is that um, each person gets a certain amount. Of, you know, in order to get what we want, quote unquote, we work very hard, and what we work very hard to get is a lot of stuff because that's what's valued in the society. Um, I think it's more important to have good relationships and to be connected with people and and the advertisers pushes us to say well if we only have this thing or that thing we'll feel more connected and I think having less things will actually make us feel more connected so living communally is great too because you get to share all those things um, you get you know you don't need so much stuff um, as it says it's another direct cha challenge to the whole system and uh, it's the way I want to live.